we are asked, who do we say that Jesus is and what kingdom do we live? What Jesus are we following? There's the Republican Jesus, uh, the ones against tax increases and activist judges and for family values and owning firearms. There's a Democrat Jesus who's against Wall Street and Walmart and against uh, global warming and printing money. There is the therapist Jesus who helps us cope with all of our problems, heals our past, tells us how valuable we are. There's Starbucks Jesus who drinks fair trade coffee and loves spiritual conversations and goes to film festivals. There's open-minded Jesus who loves everyone all the time no matter what except for people who aren't as open-minded as he is. There's touchdown Jesus. Okay? Who helps athletes run faster and jump higher than non-Christians and determines the outcome of Super Bowls. There's martyr Jesus, a good man who died a cruel death so we can feel sorry for him every day. There's gentle Jesus who is meek and mild, has high cheekbones, long brown flowing hair, and looks suspiciously German. There's hippie Jesus who encourages us to reach our full potential, to reach for the stars and buy a boat. There's spirituality Jesus who hates religion, churches, pastors, priests, doctrine, would rather have people go out in nature finding God there. There's platitude Jesus, good for Christmas specials, greeting cards, bad sermons, inspiring people to believe in themselves. There's revolutionary Jesus who teaches us to rebel against the status quo, to stick it to the man, blame things on the system. There's boyfriend Jesus, I especially like him, who wraps his arms around us as we sing about his intoxicating love in our secret place. And there's good example Jesus who shows you how to help people change the planet and become a better you. Who's my Jesus? Is it King Jesus? Is this the one we follow? I don't think those Jewish pilgrims in Jerusalem that day were any different than you and I. I really don't. They, they weren't weaker. They weren't more greedy. They, they did not have less character or courage than you and I. They were living in the wrong kingdom, and they thought they knew the king, but they didn't. 